Hello everyone. And oh Jesus, I'm dying today. Hello everyone. And yes, I am gonna record Mario 64. Don't worry about that. But this video is gonna be me versus a a bigger um Pokemon YouTuber. Hey, his channel's called Cuba Whack, and he did he it might actually still be going while I'm recording this. But he did a live stream of him battling his viewers or subs. And I happened to become the first one, which is kind of amazing. So today, I have a battle for you. It's actually pretty interesting. It's short-ish, but it's decent. I will leave a link to one of his videos down below in the description. Go check him out. He's a good guy. He's also quite PG. More PG than me, at least. <laughs> so... He's going to send out his Gastrodon, and I send out my Lupin, Lopunny. So I ran Leftovers, um, Bounce, I think High Jump Kick or Jump Kick, one of the two. Dizzy Punch and Return. He goes for, he goes for the Toxic. I go for the Bounce. It does near to nothing on him. He goes for Skull. And now right here, he's actually done a prediction, in a way. So I'm going to recover from the leftovers. And he's go I'm going to use bounce, because I outspeed. He goes for the skull. Knowing that would miss. I get healed by the leftovers. I get the hit off on bounce. Which does a little bit of damage. He goes for the toxic. That that was incredibly smart. Um, so now leftovers does absolutely nothing to me. For me, it just keeps me, it just barely keeps me alive for any time at all. So yeah, um, I go for the return, which is gonna hurt. He goes for the earth power, and I tank that actually somewhat well. I'm going to get healed with our covers and take more toxic damage. And, yeah. So far, we're pretty close on health. I go for the return, and that is enough to take out the Gastrodon. So, I healed with leftovers. And then, I'm going to die to toxic, I believe, this turn. So, out comes... Haunch Crow. Jesus, Haunch Crow. Oh, God, where do we start? Haunch Crow goes for the Sucker Punch, and that is enough to take out the Law Punny. So I send out Porygon Z. You all know what this Porygon Z set is it's Citrus, Recycle, Tri Attack, Psychic, and Recover. So I go for the Tri Attack, and I get the freaking Freeze Hacks. Everyone in chat when this happened was spamming hacks. I call hacks, 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 hacks. <laughs> it was beautiful. So I switch out to my um Chesto Rest Sleep Talk Psychic Flamethrower Wigglytuff. And I use a flamethrower, and that is enough to take out the haunch crow. There was a bit of trolling in this game too. So out comes his Torterra. So I switch Wigglytuff, even though I could have gone for Flamethrower, but I wanted to try something. So I go for the Porygon. He goes for the Heavy Slam, expecting me to stay in. <laughs> so now I go for the Tri Attack. No, I don't get any statuses. <laughs> he goes for the Wood Hammer. I'm like, let's use this to the advantage. So, that activated my Citrus Berry. And now, for the next, like, five turns, this is the exact move. I go for Recycle, I get the Citrus Berry, he goes for Wood Hammer. So yeah, this happens for a little while, actually.
So my plan here was to kill, just keep doing this and kill him with the recoil damage. So that light didn't happen because he did actually catch it on. Which was unfortunate, but it, it was fun. I had a blast doing this battle. So obviously the citrus berry won't save me forever, but it'll save me for a decent amount. So I go for the recover. So there goes the wood hammer. And this I believe is where he catches on. I go for the recover. And he goes for the earthquake. Yeah, this is where he catches on. And I barely live with the critical. That mattered. It mattered quite a bit. I go for the psychic. And he lives on 4 HP. Yay. I go for the earthquake again. And that is enough to take out Porygon. Or he goes for the earthquake again. And that is enough to take out Porygon Z. So now it's Wigglytuff versus Torterra. So he goes for the heavy slam. And believe it or not, I actually live. I live with 85 health. I go for the flamethrower. And that is enough to take out the Torterra. If you all enjoyed it, and hopefully we'll have more of this eventually. Peace. Also, please check out his YouTube channel. I will link. A video down in the description.